Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. We're going back, well, not back, we're going left to 2-5 back in the desert to 100% this level. Let's get it started, and there's a bunch of pokies. Um, this is a Yoshi-themed level, may I add. Uh, you'll see why in just a second. Uh, these pokies are, like, they turn from their normal spiky self to a melon kind of pokey. Like, see that? When they turn into melons like that, you can, uh, instead of picking them off one piece at a time until you get to the head, you can pick them off all at once when they turn into a melon. It's a pretty interesting concept to the po whole pokey thing since they're always ultra tall like that. Now watch. And Yoshi will make an egg for that whenever he eats enough melons like that and the eggs contain power-ups and stuff like that. Very, very cool and creative concept, I have to say. Anyway, uh, 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 I see that coin in the clouds, and I also see a lake, lake in two... Oh, uh, poop. No, Yoshi, don't go in the quicksand. Don't swim in the quicksand. Quicksand is not for dinosaurs. <laughs> it's pretty hard to get Yoshis back if they fall into quicksand. You gotta time your sinking in tune with them. Do I need the lake two to get up there? No, 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 no. no. I will not... I will not get hit by a spiny... Ugh. Hmm. How do I get up? Well, this works. You can go play in that holy Yoshi. I want the star coin. <laughs> Ooh, what is this? I betcha it's a vine. I betcha it's a... Freaking! Uh, what's in there? I'm all curious now. Uh, maybe those are vines and that block is a stopper point. Let's see if I can kill my... No, oh, I guess I can't kill him without Yoshi. Poopers! Man, I'm really curious what's in that block now. Because <laughs> I don't remember hitting that block before. I probably did, I just don't remember. Because it's like right on the pathway up to that coin, so... Oh, why did I do that? Um... Can I hit that question mark block over... No, no it's... What's in there? Oh, it's just coins. Never mind. Useless! Useless information! Like a lot of my videos. Oh, oh, I always see a secret here. Um, if you have Yoshi, you're supposed to pop on that piranha plant to get underneath there. Yoshi can hop on certain enemies, but with Mario, you're gonna either have to do a really precise jump or take a hit to get down here. Uh, this is a glow block. If you lift them up, needless to say, it glows or makes the area glow around you. You can throw it at enemies. It will never break. But you can lose it down a pit and stuff like that, obviously. And, uh, whoa, I almost took a hit from the fireball there. I'm pretty sure there is a start. Oh, there is, and I need Yoshi, don't I? Or maybe I don't. Maybe I can get away with the wall kick. Let's position this. Oh, that's a little too far. Now let's try and... Oh, that works. Okay, I can get it with a wall kick. That's coin number two. And that's all there is to this area, unless you want to collect some coins. Besides the star coin, of course. But who cares about regular coins, honestly? Uh, unless lives really matter in a game, uh, in a Mario game, I should say, no one really collects coins. Uh, oh, whoa, 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 that was a close one. And I could use Captain Burton Slurp here for later, couldn't I? I really want to see what's in that uh, box way back at the beginning, but um, I'm a little too far into the level now. And, uh, come on, Yoshi. You can do it. There you go. Come on, turn into a melon. There we go. Yay! Power-ups for the win! And let's get another power-up. Come on, there we go. What do I get for my trouble? Regular mushroom. Dang it! I know you can get more than that. Where is the last coin, anyway? What's in this egg? Coins! Coins! Why are you pooping out gold, Yoshi? Are you going to ever turn to a uh, melon critter, please? Wait, wait, wait. I'm missing co a coin. Ah. Oh, wait. I, I, I can eat you. Oh, I just pooped out the, pooped the egg right in the pit. Dang it. Uh, where's the last coin, then? Ah. I, I must go back to get the coin. Wait, wait, wait. I bet you it's up in this cloud. No, 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 no. Yoshi. 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 There we go. <laughs> wait, wait, is there any way to, like, yeah, I can't Yoshi jump in mid-air, so let's, I was gonna say, let's try and jump off the Yoshi and onto the 
link it to. I betcha there's something inside that cloud up there. No, there's coins up there, but there's not something in particular that's important. Ah. Can I eat the big piranha plant? No, I can't! I never tried that before, honestly. Wait, can I go down this pipe? Or is that the exit pipe? That's the exit pipe. Low on time! Low on time! What is this blast for me? Do I really have to... Like... Oh! Maybe I have to steal... Lake lack it to whatever you want to call him, to uh, get up somewhere. Like, let's, let's just leave Yoshi there. There's a bunch of coins in that cloud there. Uh, is there a star coin in here? No? There it is! There it is! There it is! No! I need to go back and get my uh, <clears throat> ride here. He's not too far away. Ugh, but I am being bombarded from the sky! All over the place! There we go. <laughs> Let's try this again. I will get that coin. Heed my words. Ah, I hate that he always moves with the screen instead of moves with you. It makes him very, very hard to jump on. Come on. Come on. Must time this just right, because I'm, as you can see, low on health here. Well, not low on health, I'm small, Mario. Ah, come on. No, no. Yep. Oh, I forgot about the time, that's right. <laughs> well, I guess I have to restart this area anyway. Whatever. Uh, there's no... I didn't hit any checkpoints? What a ripoff! Okay, I'm back over here, this time with a lot more time. And I've also got a power-up as well as a Yoshi, and I don't need it whatsoever now. Okay, this time I'm flying high just to make sure, and I'm always gonna make sure I'm holding right the whole time. There's the coin. And let's get over this. Ah, screw it, I'll just take the hit. That's the level! Woo! I can't keep Yoshi with me anyway, so... Whatever. I could've just went under that pokey, but... So I'm just gonna go over to 2-6 now, which has the other secret exit at this level. And you'll notice that there is a lot of quicksand over there. That's actually a sand trap minigame area. I'll show you what that does later. But as for now, I'm just gonna go into 2-6 and get both exits as well as the coins out of this level. And the coins are dancing! <laughs> See what I mean? About Miyamoto doing crack. <laughs> Oh, gotta love Nintendo. They're dancing with the music. They're so happy. They love the music as much as I do. And isn't there a coin coming up? Yeah, there is. Just trying. There we go. Get it with the shell. And it's a good thing I remember that coin was there. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have missed that without having a propeller mushroom. Um, if I go on top of those blocks, do I get a propeller mushroom? I don't remember, honestly. I know that there's something up there. There's a question mark box which may or may not hold a prize that I could use. You? I could use that! Really could use that. And up here is a pipe, as I described to you just a minute ago. Let's go inside it and see what is its content. Another star coin. Oh, these are propeller blocks. Uh, they work exactly like your propeller suit does, basically. <laughs> So, they aren't really special compared to the propeller suit, except that you are carrying them and you're not, so you can't carry anything else when you're holding the block, so it's a little bit more of a disadvantage than having the propeller suit. And, oh, why did I jump the gun there? I need that for the secret exit. Uh, maybe I'll get another propeller suit later on. I should say a propeller mushroom. There's a checkpoint. What does this give me if I hit it? Even the boxes are dancing. That is the silliest thing ever. <laughs> and there's a bunch of a dotted line coins. There's a fire chomp going there. It's danger left, right, up and down. And peace switch. What prizes do you have in store for me? A run for my propeller... I really don't care about those coins right now, I just want this one. And don't explode next to me, please, thank you. Okay, a pipe is coming up to the right side, um, 
like near the goal, there's gonna be a pipe coming up, and it's way, way high up that you, and you need the propeller seat to get to it. So just be on the lookout for it and be careful of uh, him, uh, Mr. Flame Chomp guy. I don't know. I can't think of a funny name to come up with. And there. Ah, oh, I missed that. So close. Okay, let's let's wait for him to go away. <laughs> I guess he's gonna he's gonna be very much in the way. I know I can get it from over here. Yeah. Oh, so close. I was just a little bit too far there. Okay, wait for it. To edge to point straight up, and yes, got it! Yeah, I'm getting the secret eggs at first because it's slightly harder, so might as well do it first. And if you didn't notice, the goal was right over to the right side, the normal exit. So let's get this goal, and I'll see you at the next goal, because I can pretty much just, like, cut ahead. And we're nearing the end of the track, the secret exit is directly above me, and over to here, there's a pipe, and this will lead you right to the end. So, let's get to it! Uh, these blocks, yes, they are gonna dance as well. They're gonna try and offset me, but it failed, I got to the goal! Yay! Um, before I end off this part, I'm probably gonna show off that little sand trap minigame place, as well as the mushroom house. Well, it's not so much a minigame as it is one of those battle yeah. arenas to collect things, to get items. Uh, the secret exit took you to the path to the right, and that leads you over to this cannon, which, again, I say I'm not gonna show, because you don't need it for 100%, and I don't want to spoil future levels, so let's just do this. Uh, you see those little holes that just appeared there? Those are trap holes. They seem to be random, to, for all I know, but... Uh, oh, this is just a star toad house. This will give me a star item. Um, but whenever you land on a space and one of those holes appears right underneath you, you end up in the sand trap minigame battle arena place, whatever you want to call it, right away. And let's see if I can get it to happen. Come on. I want it to happen at least once, please. It's like they're avoiding me. When, I, when I'm not filming, these things always get me the first time, I swear. Let's go to a space that they never... Jesus Christ. Come on. you got to eventually go to one of these two spaces. Come on, man. Please? I'm begging you. There we go. <laughs> so, two-dash toad collector emblem ball thing. As you can see, there's eight of them to get, and these are spinies that are on the ceiling. When you get near them, they fall off and then start bouncing along the floor like an upside-down turtle shell. Very predictable, very easy to dodge, and that's really all there is to it. It's just like that Goomba event in the uh, World 1. <clears throat> so, that's all that I'm going to be doing in this part. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part when I do... World 2's castle, and probably at the start of World 3. See you then!